Protein powder versus creatine. Creatine or protein? That is the question. They're inarguably the two most popular supplements amongst athletes, power lifters and bodybuilders, and for good reason. Both offer tremendous benefits such as increased power output and aiding in muscle growth, something everybody wants. So what's the difference between creatine and protein? Let's find out. Number 1. What is creatine? Simply put, creatine is an energy source for your body. Your body utilizes three main energy pathways to do work, such as lifting a dumbbell, walking or sprinting. There's the anaerobic glycolytic pathway, providing energy from between 30 seconds to 2 minutes, such as bodybuilding style training, the aerobic energy pathway, used during long periods of exercise such as steady-state cardiovascular work, and the phosphocreatin ATP pathway, used for short bursts of powerful movements, such as sprinting or lifts of extremely high loads. Number 2. What is whey protein? Whey protein is the shorthand term for the different proteins that can be isolated from whey. Whey is the liquid fraction of milk when it is separated during the process of making cheese. The protein found in milk consists of about 80% casein and 20% whey. In the process of making cheese, the fatty solids are coagulated leaving the protein-rich liquid in the form of whey. Number 3. Creatine versus Whey protein differences the real difference between creatine and whey protein is the chemical makeup of the two supplements. Creatine is an amino acid derivative. It is not a complete protein and therefore does not contain all the biochemical components that form muscle proteins in the body. However, as an essential chemical feature of muscle protein synthesis. Whey protein is a complete protein. Since it contains all the amino acids the body requires to not only build muscle, but also perform numerous other metabolic functions, it can lead to increased muscle growth. Number 4. When to take creatine. Evidence suggests that the best time to take creatine is shortly before or after you exercise. This seems to work better than supplementing hours after exercise. Researchers found that over a 10-week study those that took creatine supplements within a short period before or after exercise demonstrate significant muscle gains over those that took creatine supplement hours before or after their training. Number 5. Benefits of Whey Protein That whey protein supplements provide valuable benefits to athletes is well known. But there are many other benefits of whey protein. Since there has been so much research on whey protein, it should be no surprise that other benefits have been linked to whey protein supplements beyond the obvious benefits for fitness. No matter which protein you choose, if you're looking to bulk up, timing is everything. You should eat small amounts of protein throughout the day, but consuming high-quality whey protein immediately after exercise is the most effective way to ensure your body will have the resources needed to repair and rebuild muscle. 